And there's the next pinky, <clears throat> a little bit thicker one. Doesn't look like there are any moving parts there. <clears throat> But I'm going to try to give him a hot air shower. See what happens if it, any, anything at all. Oh, well, if there are no moving parts, it's not going to work, right? <clears throat> This one looks almost like a creature. I was about to measure it to show it uh, to a ruler how big it is, how small it is. And that's why it got kicked off. Here's one more time my tweezer coming in so nice and yellow. Oh, it's getting attached to it. Look at this, it's attached to it. Of course, it may eventually fall off because they like to do that. So it's about uh, was one third, one fourth of a millimeter in diameter. <clears throat> So if we lose them, that's okay. We've got enough of them. But having more, why not? He's got his tentacles spread. We'll try to get it off. If it falls off, okay. It doesn't find over there. Mm, not to get too many vibrations to fall it off. Make it fall off, right? Um, let's see if I find it. Oops. I have to lean under something. That's even better, look at this. He attached himself on it. That's what it I guess he knew what I was about to do. <clears throat> so I better get him to safety now. Before he decides to do something stupid. Nice winter we're having now, it's raining outside. <coughs> Typical German weather. So as I was moving him to the side, he just let go, but uh, you know, he landed on the platform where I'm filming here, <coughs> so I could find him eventually. Now I'm going to drop it into a jar <coughs> where I collect all my crusts, just for the case of something, who knows what. <coughs> 